Now to an exclusive interview with Drew Peterson and his fiance. The couple sat down for their first television appearance together with our national correspondent, Amy Robach. Amy, good morning. Matt, good morning to you. After calling the engagement a publicity stunt and breaking up last week, Drew's fiance has now moved back into his home in Bolingbrook, Illinois. Sitting by his side, 24-year-old Christina Raines told me she still plans to marry the 55-year-old Peterson. Drew is under suspicion for the death of his third wife. He's been implicated in the disappearance of his fourth wife. And a lot of people think, why would you put yourself in the situation of becoming potentially his fifth wife? Well, first, I don't believe that he did anything wrong. And well, I love him. I have a lot of fun. How would you describe the Drew that you know versus the Drew that other people have seen portrayed in the media? Very kind and loving. Very nice. <clears throat> he makes me laugh. <laughs> what makes Chrissy different from wives one, two, three, and four? It's a feeling. I mean, she's not an heiress. She doesn't have millions I'm after. I mean, she's, you know, a simple girl, and she's uh, got a couple kids, and all I want from her is her love. The two live in the same house that Peterson shared with his fourth wife, Stacy, who vanished in October of 2007. I see Stacy's picture right. on the wall. I see her uh, presence everywhere. Right. Chrissy, is that hard for you to see her presence everywhere? It looks like she don't want to answer. <laughs> Since Stacy mysteriously disappeared and the death of his third wife was ruled a homicide, Peterson says he has never had problems dating. How many women have you dated since then? A few. A couple. I can't even count. You know, I'm going out, you know, here and there. They come up to you? Sometimes. Sure. You know, just being out there. And this, it's funny. Uh, Women, for some silly reason, are attracted to that, and I can't explain it. I don't understand it, but attracted to the danger, perhaps, or the I don't know. See, once people start knowing me and my personality kicks, and I think people are attracted to my personality. So, um, I think Chrissy's attracted to my personality. So, certainly not my good looks. <laughs> Chrissy, I mean, was there a dangerous, like you know, the notoriousness? I mean, you think of Drew Peterson, you think. A lot of things. Was that attractive at all? No. Mm -hmm. No, I'd known him from before, and he's always been nice to me. So. You've known him from before. You've known him when he was still married to Stacy. Yes. So when all of this news broke and Stacy disappeared, what did you think? I felt bad for him. I felt like she was like kidnapped or something. But that's it. I didn't think that he did anything to her. People who are watching say, what is this girl thinking? Why would she even take a chance? What if he is guilty? What do you say to those people? I'm running the other way. I'm just joking. <laughs> I just don't believe it. I don't believe it. Why are you so sure? I don't believe he'll hurt anyone. What about Drew makes you believe that? What have you seen? What have you heard from him that makes He's you believe nice. that? He's nice. He has a good heart. Very caring. And I don't think he'll ever hurt me or anyone else. Do you have anybody who supports your decision to be with Drew? No. Your mom? My mom. There you go. I mean, she's not out there, like, saying it. But Anyone else? No. No, no one else. What do you say to them? That I'm going to be okay. Nothing's going to happen to me. That's all I can say. Do they believe you? No. No. Do you understand why? Yes. Chrissy's father, Ernest Rains, has said he fears for his daughter's life. He called you the devil. Exactly. So, but it looks like the devil actually won this round. So, <laughs> But before getting married, Drew still needs to divorce his former wife, Stacy, who he believes is alive. 
Do you all have wedding plans? Whatever she wants. What do you want? <laughs> I just want my family. I know. I'm making fun again. Do you think that you will have your family with you at your wedding? I hope so, but probably not. My dad already made it clear that it's not going to happen. So, Do you have any sense of timing as to when you all would be able to get married, when you could get the divorce, when you could actually have a wedding? I really don't know, but I'm hoping for as soon as possible. Chrissy, what time frame would you put wedding plans in? June or July. I'm curious, as you guys kind of plan your lives together, have you all talked about having children together? No, I think we have enough children. Between us, we have eight and a grandchild coming, so it's like I think that's enough. You're 55, though. Mm -hmm. Chrissy's just 24. Right. Chrissy, do you want more kids? One more. Maybe one more. You've obviously had to make a lot of sacrifices. Your father, your friends. What do you want out of this relationship? Family. Is Drew family? Yes. Well, they both say that this is not for publicity, it's not for money, but Drew Peterson did tell me he would be willing to do a reality show, movie, a book deal, whatever, to tell his story. And Matt, he said he would take that money to increase his nest egg for his children. All right, Amy, thanks for that. We appreciate it.